Yes. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to our analysis. The politics of this country is now taking shape. And there are several activities happening across the country. Dr. William Samoy Ruto's running mate, Rigadi Gashagwa, had a series of rallies in Kiabu County. The rallies in some of parts of the county were successful, but the others were not. So today, we want to analyze a video that is now trending online. Where Rigadi Gashagwa was heckled by Raila Amolo Odinga supporters in Gidunguri constituency. Rigadi Gashagwa is on record stating that selling Raila in the mountain is like selling pork in a mosque. Yes, that one is on record. So guys, today you want to look at this video, bisect it and place it where it belongs politically speaking. Yes, watch into the video and let's get back after that. <laughs> Yes, that's the video. Rigadi Gashagwa came across Raila Amolo Odinga supporters in Gudunguri constituency. This man was heckled and out of hunger, he couldn't control himself. Rigadi Gashagwa has been telling people that selling Raila in the mountain is like selling a pork in a mosque. What happened today? Such a thing in the recent past, let's say in from 2018, no one believed such a thing can happen in the mountain. So guys, today you want to look at the reasons as to why this might have happened. Number one, the UDA team and the UDA members are assuming that they already have the mountain. Dr. William Samoy Ruto have been campaigning on the mountain since 2018. So they assume that they have the mountain. While they are in the mountain, they are always selling propagandas, propagandas and lies. There is nothing new since 2018 up to new that Dr. William Samoy Ruto and his team is telling the people of the mountain. And this could be the reasons as to why there is a shift in politics in that area. With the entry of Martha Karwa, the, this has totally changed the equation for Ruto. And he is getting it tough because in the last for years, he the only thing he has been telling the mountain people is that people, some people are trying to hate him. Those people, what were kitted the willy, those are the things that he's been selling to the people. But now, the entry of Martha and Martha is explaining to him to the people and telling them what they can do for them. Number two is the is lack of persuasive language from Rigade Gashagwa. 
once Rigathi Gelashagwa met with Raila Amolo Odinga's supporters, let's assume those who are true supporters, he couldn't control himself, but instead started answering them with bitterness. As a politician, that shouldn't happen. You should look for a way to control the crowd. If you can remember, Mata Karwa was heckled in Kirinyaga, but instead, he said and asked those people who sent the youths to heckle him to come themselves instead of using other people's children to achieve their political objectives. Mata Karwa has a specific language, whereas Rigadi Kashagwa doesn't have. Yes. Number three, I'm trying to assume that Mount Kenya is becoming a battleground. And if as a new team is going to play his cards well, the team might go beyond and win 30% plus. Because initially, the plan was for Ayla to only get 30% from the mountain. But as it stands now, Raila can eventually go ahead and win the support of the people of the mountain. So with all this, the Uda team is getting it rough in the mountain. The bitterness and everything. And it is a fact that Raila is gaining support daily in Mount Kenya. Whereas Dr. William Samuel Ruto is decreasing and reducing his popularity in the mountain. Those are my thoughts. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing like this video and leave your comment to our subscribers i want to continue thanking you for your continued support and please give this video a thumbs up let's meet in the next video and let god bless kenya